Well, Joe Rash, welcome back here to Ireland. The end of the sun is shining down here at Clontarf Cricket Club. Beautiful day, beautiful morning, Laura. Yeah, it is. It I'm is really gorgeous. Anyway, Laura Delaney, Orla Prender, uh, Gast, and of course, Nevo Shea is with us. And first up, we start with you, Laura, because it is a massive weekend of sports, especially for women's cricket. Yeah, it's brilliant to see that the games this weekend, the two T20 games, are going to be covered by Virgin Media. The girls had a really successful end to the tournament up north, winning that last game against England so hopefully we get a really good turnout and, and can't wait to support the girls. Yeah now you were up in Belfast there last Sunday how did it go for you? Yeah I suppose the first two games went England's way but Ireland bounced back really well and, and had a very convincing win there at the end so looking forward to, to seeing them go out and, and play with the same fight on Saturday and Sunday. Now it's uh, over two days Saturday and Sunday the T20 International would you explain what T20 is? Yeah so I suppose there's two formats the T20 is a 20 over game there's two teams one team bats first and tries to score as many runs as they can and then at the end of their 20 overs they swap over and the other team bat and I suppose the fielding team try and defend the runs that they've scored. Yeah, now Laura, cricket is a growing sport. I mean, it's the second biggest sport in the world, right? But it's growing here in Ireland. Yeah, it is and it's brilliant to see, I suppose, when now we're on full-time contracts and, and hopefully it encourages younger girls to stick with the game and see that there's a potential career option there as a female athlete. And uh, for viewers tuning in this one, would you explain very briefly briefly the quick rules of cricket oh you stitched me up here <laughs> um yeah there's there's a lot of different rules in cricket but i suppose one team is trying to score as many ru as runs as possible you have 11 wickets so if each person gets out the team swaps over and then the opposition is trying to score more runs than them all right uh, orla you are one of the young stars of the game at the moment and of course you started your career in pembroke i did yeah um i've been there for about the last 10 years or so um yes every summer go down and play there um, day in day out and have a lot of good memories there. Now where are you playing on the pitch at the moment? Uh, I am an all-rounder so I bat and I bowl. Um, I generally bat number three in T20s and I often open bowling. Okay um, I believe you had a massive success quite recently because you scored a century. I did yeah um, against Sri Lanka in our first championship win um, a few weeks ago now and um, yes that was a great day personally but a huge day for us as a team um, to come away with that first championship win. Yeah, now will you explain to viewers at home, what is a century? And of course, you got the century within an inning. So what is an inning? Um, so an innings is, it can be individual or as a team. So each 11 players has an individual innings. Um, and yeah, so 100 runs is a century. Um, and yeah, everyone goes out and plays their individual innings to, to make a team one. So basically, you got 100 runs within the first half of the game. Yeah, uh, correct. Yeah, so I did that and then you go out and field and bill. And, and I mean, from there, your career has gone from strength to strength because you were playing in the Caribbean League. Yeah, um, yeah, I was. And I've gone over and I've played in England a few times. Um, so yeah, there's different kind of franchise opportunities that can come up um, when you put in performances for Ireland. Um, so yeah, they're always exciting to take on. Yeah, and of course, down under, Australia is calling. That's, uh, that's down the line for you. It is, yeah. That's coming up over the next uh, couple of months. Um, yeah, I got drafted in that a couple of weeks ago um, which was definitely a surprise but uh, so exciting um, yeah massive opportunity it's one of the biggest leagues in the world um, and we're playing with a lot of the best players in the world over there um, so very excited for that are you looking forward to this weekend yeah um, so excited obviously England are a very good side and it so excited to have them over here playing us um, in two T20s back to back on weekend days. Hopefully there'll be a good amount of supporters down um, and yeah, hopefully some good games to come. Um, Laura, you are the captain, but unfortunately you're out of action at the moment. You're injured. Yeah, I injured my ankle about four weeks ago. It was in our second T20 against Sri Lanka. I've ruptured one of the ligaments in my ankle, so I'm not going to be playing in the games this weekend. I'm out for another bit, but can't wait. So who's got the captain's airband at the moment? Gabby has it at the moment. Orla actually did have it for a little while. It's like the captain. Oh, Laura had it as well. Or Orla had it as well. She told me earlier on she wants to be the captain. But she never knows that. Um, but I mean, we've all the young players here behind us. I mean, it's fantastic to see. And they look up to you as, as, as sporting heroes, don't they? Yeah, and it's brilliant to see the likes of Orla doing so well, not only for Ireland, but being given opportunities to go overseas and, and play against some of the best players in the world and take those learnings back to our dressing room and hopefully inspire the girls behind us. All right. 
right, Orla, we're going to have a little bit of a game in a few moments' time. But first up, Neve O'Shea from Cricket Ireland. I mean, how big is it for the first time ever, Neve, Virgin Media Television are broadcasting the two days live? Well, this is huge for the entire island of Ireland. This is a huge moment for Irish cricket. Everyone is so excited. It has been the chat since we announced that we were going to be on Virgin 2. Twitter has been on fire. Oh, X, sorry, I'm yeah. my age there. Uh, X has been on fire. There's been messages flying left, right and centre. And it's such a major opportunity for the girls to be able to show the brilliance of their game, how good they are. These are world-class players. So while um, cricket is the second largest sport in the world, it's growing sport here, as you've mentioned earlier. So we're so excited for everybody just to see how brilliant cricket is. And of course, for women, sport. for women's sport in particular. Uh, uh, Absolutely. I mean, these these girls that you just spoke to Laura and Orla there and Gabby will be leading the team out now at the weekend. But they're just absolute champions and they are the most brilliant sports ambassadors this country has. We're so proud of them. Abs- we can't wait to cheer them on Absolutely. Of course, we have live coverage of that over on Virgin Media 2 this Saturday and Sunday kicking off at 2.30. That's correct. All right, before we let you go, we're going to bat, we're going to bat a few balls here. Orla, she's one of the top players in the world. Right, Orla, you know I'm a Limerick man now. <laughs> I love the bit of hurling. Are we ready to go? So here's our first one. That's oh, that's a miss anyway. I'm listening to a miss there. Let's go. <laughs> Peach of a Oh, that's Woo, too bad. What a oh, shot. That's more. That was a near there miss for us. Come on, Orla. We had to duck. This oh, Partick and the debutante is really one showing one his one skill one here. One. Come on, Orla. This is Three, his first two, time one. in the Ireland jersey. Oh, oh close, <laughs> nearly caught looks, behind. Right? <laughs> Where can we find out more online? Cricketireland.ie All right, and don't forget, we do have live coverage, as I mentioned, Virgin Media 2, this Saturday and Sunday from 2.30. Enjoy the game. Back to you guys in studio. Loving that, Orla. <laughs> You're God, very fast I think he's doing very well. And of course, don't forget, as Eric already mentioned, tune in tomorrow <laughs> as Ireland will host England in Qatar for the first of two T20 internationals. Yeah, live coverage gets underway at half two on Virgin Media 2.